Hi everyone, Chad here on the Nomadic Scooter Channel. Thanks for watching this week's episode. On this episode, I'm in Moab, Utah. I've got out an InMotion V11 wheel uh, EUC that I bought off Amazon. I'm at the Slick Rock bike trail. I'm not taking it on the bike trail. Uh, this is a little technical, uh, the Slick Rock bike trail for what I'm doing. Today, mostly what I'm gonna be doing is just getting the EUC unboxed, the InMotion V11, get it unboxed, uh, get it set up. You gotta install an app on your phone to connect with the unit. Uh, and testing it out. From what I've seen on other YouTube videos that uh, it takes some learning curve, uh, a couple of hours to get to learn. And that's why I came out to this big parking lot and I figure uh, I'm at the Slick Rock bike trail. So I figure this is a nice big flat parking lot. Uh, I'll practice on the EUC, see if I can get the hang of it and uh, you know start learning how to ride one. I don't expect to get it all today. I think it's probably gonna take me, you know, a couple of times of taking it out and practicing for a couple of hours. So it's probably gonna take me a few months uh, in my free time taking the EUC out and uh, testing it out to see how it works and everything. So uh, if, you, if you're new to the channel and you like electric scooters, uh, one wheels and uh, adventure travel, uh, my channel's Nomadic Scooter. I travel to different locations uh, throughout wherever I can film uh, a scooter video, state parks, uh, city centers, anywhere like that and uh, I film uh, these scooter videos. So if you like it, check out my other videos. Make sure you hit like, hit subscribe, and hit the bell notification. That way you know when I upload a new video. Uh, thanks, and check out my other videos. All right, so turning the unit on, what you want to do is uh, get the kickstand up, and that's the power button right there. Make sure you got it somewhat level. There you go. Now it's self-balancing. Um, I haven't ridden one of these before, so <laughs> I don't even know how to get on it, but let's see. I've already aired up the suspension, too, so you can see it's got air in it. It comes with a comes with like this uh, air pump and and you just pump it up down here under here okay I'm gonna use the box as support to get on it okay I'll see here <laughs> that's the really funkiest thing they make this look so easy in the other YouTube videos. These guys who have, have been riding these EUCs for a long time, they just jump on them. I can tell you, I haven't had that easy of a time trying to get on these, on this unit. <laughs> nope, I'm getting it going. <laughs> That's what I mean by like learning, because what you, I mean, I think if you've got confidence and you just kind of get on it, like you've done it hundred times, there it goes. Okay, so let's try this out. Let's kick the kickstand up, turn it on. All right, let's see here. Here we go. <laughs> okay. There we go, I got it. <laughs> Definitely a learning curve uh, to this, but kind of just jump on it. 
Get going there like that. I see these other YouTubers flying on this thing, but I mean, it's definitely gonna take, they tell you you're supposed to look just straight ahead when you're riding it, like where you wanna go. Okay, that's not too bad. I've only ridden this thing a couple of times, so I mean, if I can do it, if I can do this thing, then you know, you guys can do it, buy one and go to a parking lot or something and practice where it's flat. And uh, do, do, do. here you are, nomadic scooter. <laughs> like I say, it's gonna take me a little bit of time here to get the hang of this thing. And uh, but once I get on, it's not too bad. It's just getting comfortable. It's such a a different machine to be on that uh, it's not like a scooter you can just stand or I mean it feels good now like I say come to a big parking lot like this where you can uh, you know practice that's what I'm doing where I've got room don't practice in the road and go out in front of a car or something so I mean it feels good now whoa but uh, definitely wear your safety gear with this thing or jeans at least so if you fall off it's not gonna be too bad I mean, I don't know how fast this thing goes. I think like 25 miles an hour. I'm just going pretty easy now. But from what uh, what other YouTuber said is uh, like Ginger on wheels, he says to look straight ahead, you know, where you're going. Just keep looking forward and uh, don't look down because if you look down, you're going to crash. Just look straight up ahead and, uh, and just go slow with it, you know, get the hang of it, how, how it... Uh, it's gonna drive and whoa, it's a tight turn. Okay. <laughs> okay, so you see, I'm getting right on it, no wall or nothing. <laughs> uh. All right, guys, so there you go, the InMotion V11, 18-inch uh, wheel. And uh, it's a great unit. I uh, really like it. I like, uh, I like this uh, handle. When, once you turn it on, it's got a handle that flips out. It's very easy to, uh, and portable to move around with the handle. I even took it up some steps earlier. Um, and the motor will turn the wheel and walk it right up steps. So if you're thinking, oh, this might be hard to lift and bring it to like a Starbucks or something, it's not. You can just leave the unit on so it self-balances use the handle and bring it right into uh, wherever you got to go. It'll climb right up steps. So uh, like I say, this is my first time riding one. I took it out, just tried it out a little bit. And uh, it was pretty good. So it's got these folding uh, foot pegs. They're pretty sturdy. Um, what else? It's got a front headlight and a rear tail light. It's got uh, your charging ports in the back right here. Two charging ports and a USB port to charge your phone or something with. So yeah, the in motion V11. I'll put a uh, I'll put a uh, Amazon affiliate link in the description. So if it's uh, something you're looking to pick up, use my link and uh, check it out. So I'll be getting this out in future videos and uh, be doing some more practicing on it and try to get better on it and uh, and go from there. So yeah, thanks for watching. Watch my other videos. I'll see you on the next episode. Bye now.